Welcome back, everybody. So I kind of want to do a video of kind of the essentials you should bring if you go if you're going on any trips. So I'm currently actually on vacation. Um, I didn't actually do a video before leaving the house. My bad. It was late at night. That's why. So, but obviously, you need to have toothbrush, toothpaste. I do have some band aids in here, but also mouthwash as well. You know, longer hair, need it, shorter hair too. But so I do bring, it is my gentle cleansing mask. I got it on one of my Ipsy, Epsy, whatever box. Neosporin that kind of goes with that husband's <laughs> deodorant. My deodorant. And then getting pretty low. I do need to get a new one, but this is all uh, ooh, bah, bah. <laughs> my moisturizing cream. And then I also, I use a dark spot one. This is kind of my thing that I have to do just because I don't know if you guys have seen over the years, I have a spot here. It's slowly decreased, but not so much, but that helps me so I found this little thing on Amazon. This is amazing. So it is a pill holder. Now it doesn't hold a whole lot, let alone trying to get it to close was interesting, but got some Tums in there, got some Tylenol, got some ibuprofen, but this is awesome. I'll link it below if you guys are interested in it. But another reason why I like it, it's compact. It'll fit in your purse. The only thing is with two areas not being used, this thing, you can beat someone with it. It's kind of heavy. It's kind of, but it, it's nice. It it doesn't hold a whole lot, but it holds enough that you would need on a like a week trip. So always, always make sure lotion, body lotion. Um, I do have sunscreen, but that's actually in with our like being a suit stuff like that. The spray one, sports one, 50, 50 SP, I think, or something. Always make sure. <laughs> so when scrubbing the face make it easy and then so where we're staying they tend to have actual like cloths for your face which i need to find we just got here so and then lastly but not least i know it looks like a little wallet it's not i promise because you never know it is a full kit i got this off of amazon i had to think but it's perfect for traveling because it's in its own case, but tweezers in there, scissors, clipping your nails, obviously, but kind of the essentials just in case you get a hangnail, whatever it is. But I do have everything um, kind of put in the container. So my little Hello Kitty container. Okay, I'll take that out. But yeah, just a simple, It's they say it's waterproof. I don't think it is, but that's about it. And then if you're a female, might need some feminine products with you. So make sure, make sure to pack or just at least have a few on you because you never know. Oh, <laughs> this might sound stupid, but bring a cup. Shower heads, for some reason, at a lot of hotels just really suck. So I have this thing when I wash my hair. Cup, perfect washing hair. I know it sounds stupid, but it's easier. It's a lot more than what comes out of a shower head. But yeah, that's kind of my go-to, what I bring on trips. It's a little bit easier, but where we stay, they do kind of provide some stuff, but with having dyed hair, I don't quite use their shampoo and conditioner just because it will strip it. Not like it matters because like I told you guys, um, Brad Mondo, I love you. Three weeks and it's faded bad. I'm almost back to square one. Um, again, didn't last a month. That's for another picture or another subject. But yeah, so I just want to do a quick little video on what I bring on a travel. So hopefully you guys have a great Memorial Day weekend. Sorry, this is a day late that I'll be posting just because we were traveling the day that I normally post and things just got hectic. But thanks again, everybody. It was great to see you. Cat, dirty princess. But thanks, everybody. Bye.